So one thing we get asked a lot about a lot is birthday parties. And um, birthday parties are a celebration, but not always for our kids. There can be um, a mixture of things that go on in the dynamics of a birthday party that can be wonderful, but can be overwhelming at the same time. So <clears throat> planning for those birthday parties is real important. As a parent who's had to do many of these birthday parties, I think a lot about the environment because I know my kids become very overwhelmed and um, the environment can be very, very overwhelming, which can affect behavior and their, their, even their ability to have fun at the party. So I think about familiar environments, something that's familiar to them. So sometimes I've done them at home. Sometimes I've gone and done it at event places that we are familiar with. Um, so that's one thing to think about. The other thing to think about is the activities that go on at a birthday party. So sometimes birthday parties don't have real flexible schedules. So um, you wanna think about how you set up that schedule. If you're a person attending the birthday party and your child has difficulty with flexibility, you might wanna ask the parent giving the birthday party what the schedule's gonna be. I would also ask about food. Diet can be a big thing. We have a lot of kids with sensitivities. Um, so as a parent planning them, I think about the people I invite. And then I also, as a parent attending, I, I will ask the host if I don't know um, whether I need to bring something that might be more sensory friendly or something my child can eat or something they can tolerate in their diet. Um, birthday parties tend to have a lot of sugar. And um, another theme I always say for birthday parties to think about is bigger is not always better. So um, sometimes I know many of my friends just have birthday celebrations with their family in a very familiar environment and that's a lot more fun to them. Um, but some of our kids, we as parents can have 25 people at a birthday party, but um, for kids that's really overwhelming and it's a lot of different behavior and a lot of different things going on at one time. So <clears throat> I always think about things like that. So in planning or in attending or um, participating or being the person that's hosting a birthday party, be mindful of the people you're inviting, be mindful of your environment, be mindful of the size and also be mindful of the food and the activities that might be going on. These are just some big points to think of. And if you have a child having a party, ask your clinician their ideas on what they would think would be optimal for your kiddo. I always like themes too. If your kid loves a theme, stick with the theme they love. 